Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Hope you're doing well. So Virgo, this reading will be for you. If you have any Virgo placements or if you're dealing with a Virgo, please take the messages that resonate with you and leave the rest for somebody else. I'm going to be seeing what is highlighted in your life right now, what's coming out, okay? So thank you so much for your patience, guys. Um, I will be doing um, more readings for the other signs. Um, I've said to myself, actually, I'm going to start doing one reading per sign each week, okay, at, at the very least. That was actually my initial um, plan when I started the channel back in March last year. So, um, but I've done more. I've actually done much more than I said I was going to, but I'm going to stick to that now so it's fair for everybody. So thank you for your patience. Virgo. Right, what is currently being highlighted right now for Virgos? trust your decisions okay trust your decisions don't overthink it virgo don't overthink it okay all right trust in your decisions tell me about virgo please what's being highlighted in their life right now whenever they watch this video let's see virgo seven of cups page of swords <laughs> ten of pentacles oh Eight of Pentacles. Two more. Seven of Wands. Two of Cups. So if you guys are keeping something to yourself, it could be your your plans, your um your the way say for example you've got a business idea or you've got a project going on. So maybe you guys are kind of keeping that on the low, or if it's a relationship also. So maybe you guys are actually keeping something from your partner as well. I don't feel like it's something that's, um, um, how can I put this? Like, terrible. It's just, maybe it's a, it's a surprise, you know? So maybe you guys have bought something really um, grand as well. Maybe a new car, maybe a new home, okay? Um, something, an item that you've been wanting, I'm seeing you work, uh, this is a bit like the Cancer's reading actually, so this is energy of like, um, your focus is your stability, is your work, your studies, okay, some of you guys are qu quite closed off at this time. People are wondering about you though, Nine of Pentacles, the Hanged Man. Pisces and Virgo energy. Some of you guys could be dealing with another Virgo, a, a Pisces, Taurus, Capricorn. Actually, we have all the signs here, but those are the ones that are um, really being, um, that's really standing out right now. Some of you guys are um, actually blocked off a connection, cut out a connection, or somebody's blocked you because it hasn't moved forward and you feel more single than you do. Even though you have love for this person, this person has love for you i feel like you feel more single and, and things aren't going the way it wants to even if you are married even if you've been with this person for a very long time for some of you guys it could be a newer connection king of pentacles queen of pen queen of wands the wheel of fortune the four of wands the emperor and the, the world some of you guys is like why am i getting this energy of things that you used to like before think like in a person in a relationship is not actually what you want or need right now something's really changed in your life so i feel like your dreams have changed your outlook on things have changed and so has your uh, perception of relationships and individuals actually it could also be friendships as well but I'm getting like, you definitely want somebody who takes more charge more. You're more attracted to somebody that's more stable. Could be like that earth sign energy as well. Some of you guys could be connecting with a fellow earth sign. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Or a fire sign. We've got mainly fire and earth here. The Emperor's Aries. Queen of Wands, Queen of Pentacles. Four of Wands. It could be a Leo there. Sagittarius. There's someone here that's ready to... um. I wanted to say step in, okay? So I'm not sure if you guys are connected with somebody right now or this is you that's, like, you know, unless someone really steps up or shows me that they are um, the kind of person that can take charge. And even if you're a male Virgo, it's kind of like you don't really want someone to sit um, 
ha- have like the back seat you kind of want to be you both want to be in the front seat like let's both drive this yeah let's both do this okay you want somebody on, on your level you don't want to have to plan everything put all the energy into something yeah you're done with that two of pentacles a hanged man three two of, pe- two of pentacles and a three of cups I'm getting you kind of in this energy of there's a few messages from that. But I'm getting this energy of you um thinking about the types of people that you've actually encountered or you've dealt with, dated, been in relationships with, and it's like, no, that's not me. Like that was only a time when I was dealing with this or whatever. So I'm getting reflecting, looking at things a whole different light. So I'm not sure what exactly what's happened to you, Virgo, to um to bring on this is if yeah hermit you guys are the hermits you guys are the hermit but i'm getting this like nah that was only because of this i was only not saying that you guys were you know like when you're going through certain things or you're, or you're, you're younger and you're not always really looking at the bigger picture i feel like you are now you're looking at the bigger picture which is helping you tremendously tell me more please nine of cups some of you guys are like, I don't even, that's not even something I say, but like, I'm a snack or I'm, you know, I'm the full deal. I'm the, I'm the, you know, I'm more. So your confidence has definitely gone up. You know what, you know your worth and you're not trying to be an option. You know that you're with somebody that's definitely, um, that's definitely worth this love, worth that kind of love. Okay. I do get this like past, um, there's these past people, there's these past connections, relationships, friendships, people that are kind of wandering about you. So you could re- you could really be keeping to yourself at this time right now, Virgo. People could be curious about um, you. I don't see you letting a lot of people in. Tell me more. The strength card. Some of you guys have really tried to pull back from these people, especially if they've been no good for you. I see you focusing on your, on your money, yeah, on your stability, your home. Ace of Cups. Tell me more, please. The Ace of Wands. Okay. So if you guys might. Page of Wands. Somebody's going to contact you out of the blue. Especially if. Okay. So this is. Some of you guys. This is not necessarily your ex. Or somebody. Somebody that you've dated before. But somebody that. A lot of you guys. For that to come out like that. For me to say that. It's like somebody that you already know. Not necessarily dated. But somebody that you know. They could be like. Hey. What's going on? Virgo. Blah. 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 So someone's seeing the change in you and they're curious. I feel like some people will reach out or have reached out already. Ten of swords here. Tell me more. Judgment. Somebody could be apologising here. Ten of swords, the judgment, the knight of swords. Somebody could be apologising to you or, or or saying, hey, how come you keep keeping to yourself? What's going on? Did someone hurt you? Are you all right? That reminds me of the Leo reading a little bit. That's what I said. If you do, if you're on the cusp of Leo and Virgo, definitely check that reading out. Or if you're dealing with one, check always check the other signs out, your other placements. Seven of Swords. Yeah, if someone did hurt you, or you're tired of dating the same people or dealing with the same kind of energies. Cause that seven of seven of swords energy is dusty. Is 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 trash. It's trash. I'm gonna be real. I don't like I don't like his face. I don't like what he what he's what he's on. I don't like it. Right, tell me more, please. Nine of Wands. Yeah. Uh, some. This is. I feel like this is the reason why a lot of you guys are closed off because you feel like if you keep putting energy towards um, certain things, it's like. It, it, do you know what I'm getting? It's like um, um, what's it called? What's that saying called? You know, repeating things the same way. And expecting um, a different result is like the is like the um that's literally insanity so some of you guys are switching up and you are closing off and you are focusing on yourself and you are reevaluating reviewing did i say review with this one or did i say it with the other sign i can't remember some of you guys are definitely on the cusp or you have uh leo in your chart somewhere There's certain things you that you just don't want. Now I feel like it's certain friends, it's certain it could be family members even, you know, people at work or how people have done you or what you've allowed people to do to you. Let me say that actually. 
okay because people will do what they're doing but as if we allow it to especially if it's more than once after a while we that's us allowing it and accepting it even though we're not actually saying that us returning or giving energy to it that's that's us allowing something okay people are highly manipulative and it's not always straightforward i completely understand but um that's the reality people will do as we allow the empress yeah this is you this is this is you this is you this is this is you're getting to a much yeah it's i'm feeling like you're elevating and people are seeing that change and it's like can i fit into leo i've not leo see some of you guys are leo can i fit into virgo's life can i even approach virgo like that you know what's what are they there's a lot of questions around you virgo but it's because you're not sharing as much as maybe you usually would okay with the people that you usually would okay i said that this is not actually i don't feel like this is a terrible thing you know there's sometimes i'll say open up do this but i feel like you have opened up with certain people and they've taken your kindness for weakness okay i'm hearing yeah they walked all over me or allowed them to whoever this is okay king of swords yeah, some of you guys are being cold towards people. I literally, some of you guys can have cancer in your chart as well because their reading was speaking about um, behaving like royalty, but not in a like look down your nose, but actually not engaging in everything that's going on around them, as in like say like arguments, you know, drama, um, things that don't need to be sp um, spoken about that doesn't concern them. Okay, I actually feel like this is this is a good thing for you. I think like this is a very natural thing for you, Virgo, to every so often reflect. And it may cause some of you guys anxiety. But I'll tell you what, for me, anxiety is something that has to be dealt with. And there's a reason why our body's telling us something, okay? It, it's saying there's something needs to be faced. So maybe you will be, will be having a conversation with somebody. Oh, my God, this is kind of weird. With the last two readings had a little bit of each. Um, all the readings that I've done, uh, Leo, Cancer, uh, Cancer Leo and, and you guys, there's something from each reading that's kind of like similar. Not all totally, but there's some something that like connected. Well, we're all, we're, we're all connected, but yeah. Maybe it's time for you to speak out about something and make it clear once and for all, wherever that is, okay? I'm going to leave it there, guys. Please like, share, subscribe. Have an amazing week ahead, and I'll see you guys in your next reading. Bye, guys.